Yowie, wowie. If this mattered, what Jonathan Hickman was writing in New Mutants, it wasn't just so Cyclops and Gladiator could chat about that gate. There's a whole lot of stuff that happened there that's being built on here. That's why I read comics, man. That's why I drop other comics. If I don't think your story is going anywhere past this story, I can do. I can spend my money on something else. Not just my time, but my money on something else. And uh, I was glad to read New Mutants. I don't think I will continue reading New, Mut New Mutants, but I was glad I read it when Hickman was writing it. Because what Rain did by picking up that egg, it's actually a king egg. Anyone play StarCraft? Doesn't it remind you of the Zerg? And uh, these things over here were those large Zergling with the tentacles that can transport all the You remember that. So the Zerg are coming and Brew knows what to do. Brew is back on vacation from the, from the North Pole, from Avengers Mountain. And apparently, hey, Gabriel didn't die. Vulcan never died. We just don't know what happened at War of Kings. I'm going to have to read War of Kings again, just like I read Deadly Genesis again. When, um, I think when, when, when Moira, issue number two of House of X, I'm like, yo, let me, I got to read Deadly Genesis, see what's going on over here. I did that just to see consistencies with Moira. But this is making me want to read the War of Kings. Maybe I'll read the one in the middle of, of Deadly Genesis and War of Kings. What was it Emperor Vulcan? Was that what the name of the story was? The Rise of the Shi'ar Empire? I have all of those trade paperbacks. I'm going to read all of them because old books matter. Ed Brubaker stuff mattered and uh, Jonathan Hickman's picking up on it, building up on it. I love it. So, Ayo, Oya, is Oya, O-Y-A, is in this comic book. New mutants being represented. Young mutants who were made recently, you know, she's one of the five lights, is being used in here. That's how it's done. You integrate them into the team. You do what you did with Gentle in X-Men Red. This is what I'm talking about. And uh, when the threat shows up, Magic and Cyclops are going to whoop ass because they are commanders. The coolest part here is here. When he asks her to make a whole bunch of teleportation discs so he can fire and fire and fire. I interpret this artwork as he's shot in a hole and... After that, he's shot in another hole. It's not like they're all happening at the same time. They're just showing you that he did this many times and not wasting a whole bunch of panels to do so. Each of these shots are individual. They didn't all just come out of his eye at the same time. But that was really cool, man. That's intelligent writing. I want to see the comic book artist show his action. And Mahmoud Asrar did that over here. Look at how expressive Ileana is over there the whole way through. It reminds me of Arrow and the way that she uses her power. And the artist there, his name is Kang, is killing it. And the writer, obviously, is finding unique ways to show how this superhero could manipulate air as her power. Um, they're going to use their intelligence. And Bruce going to interrupt Jean and say, hey, I actually know why they're here. They want the egg. And uh, intelligence is going gonna, is gonna to um, save the day. They're... They re-update the Shi'ar battleground stuff, explaining Gladiator became the Empire Emperor, taking over for Lalandra. There's a new person in town, and then when they go to start to um Star Star, what's Cyclops Daddy's team name? Star Force. That's not what it's called. His name is Quasar. Their name is Star Jammers. That's the one. When they go here, I instantly think. These guys could be the next Guardians of the Galaxy team. They're well known within the comic reader universe because they've been built on for a long, long time from what Chris Claremont was writing. These guys could get their own Disney Plus or even a film called the Star... Why did I forget their name again? Star Jammers. Can you imagine that? I can. And this could combine and connect with the Guardians in the movies. This could also make set up some, some groundwork for... The X-Men, who in any of their movies haven't been to space. That film that came out April last year doesn't count. They, they were still in the solar system. They are going to kill it if they do Star Jammers in the MCU. 
I'm ready to see that. And he's going to tell this accuser what's going on. Sunspot makes a deal with him. Hey, remember Gladiator? Kid Gladiator, this guy over here? He matters. Jason Aaron created him. And Jonathan Hickman said, what you wrote matters. Books matter. And they're going to start going on a hunt. I loved this. Action-packed. The moment with Cyclops and Ileana was all I needed. And there was more so. Seeing that something that happened in another book, New Mutants, with the egg, was uh, built up, built in here, built up here, followed up on here, is why I read comic books. Fantastic writing by Jonathan Hickman.